Yes, it's Kamikaze Yelly! As holy crap, this game's volume is so loud that I had to reduce it down to 10% in order to hopefully be heard over this. Uh, this game is called Arcane Pre-Race. Uh, it's another one of those things where I got a lovely key for. Um, it looks like an RPG Maker style game. I don't know yet, but this was uh, made by Arcane Race. Apparently the same people who did this. Uh, oh, this is Arcane Pre-Race, and it's made by Arcane Race. Weird. Uh, it says Adventure Casual Indie RPG Strategery. So, it looks like this is release date is going to be on May 2nd. So this is a, a game before its release. I have such a tiny little screen to play on, so I'm actually using my preview screen for an actual reason of having a larger game. Uh, let's just go right in. I don't know what this is about at all. Well, this looks a little messed up. Ah, my head. It hurts. Where am I? How... How did I get here? What the hell happened? I must find my way out before it's too late. Even though I have no idea what's going on. Oh, that's my mouse. Move that out of the way. Woo! I'm pretty! I got pink hair! Um... I don't know what the controls are, I just know I've got arrow keys. It is recommended to you to play the tutorial if you haven't played any of the other titles in Arcane Rays franchise. Would you like to play the tutorial for Arcane Rays franchise? And actually, let me take a look here. I'm actually going to tab over and uh, click them to see if there's others in this series. Um, I click Arcane Rays. Holy crud! So, what's on here is there's Arcane Rays demo. And there's Arcane Pre-Race. There's Arcane Re-Race, which came out April 4th. And Arcane Rays that came out on March 10th. And then there's this, which is the Pre-Race. Not the Re-Race, or the Rays. Uh, yeah, I guess I'm going to have to do the tutorial because I have no idea what's going on. Um, let's click back into the window first. Nope. Welcome to the Arcane Race franchise. This tutorial is designed to help you learn the basics of this game. It is highly recommended that you play through this level. However, you may skip the tutorial if you wish to do so. Would you like to take the tutorial? I, that's, I came here for that. Number one, move around with the directional keys. Analog stick. Two, open up the menu by pressing escape. B. Three, well, three is like on it, not even on its own line. Interact by pressing enter. Four, access options and settings. Uh, that's it? That's the tutorial? In the area up ahead, you will find some NPCs. You can talk with the other people in the NPCs by pressing enter, blah, blah. Okay, I think I get the, the gist of this. Let's go find out, like, the battle system or something. In the area up ahead, you will find some enemies. The battle starts automatically when you encounter hostile beams. Arcane Rays uses a turn-based combat system, means your party and enemies each get their own turns to execute their moves, blah blah blah. Okay, this is just pretty much typical. Heh, <laughs> you haven't encountered a battle. This will now happen, blah blah blah. Ghost, or my gird! Oh, no, wait. Oh, emerged! Whoops! I thought it was like, oh my god! Meantime! Attack. Ghost A. Now, Okay, uh, I guess it needs... What? It doesn't even give me the option to escape. It wants me to die? Fire 2. It's still not dead? What the heck? It just wants me to die during the tutorial. Welcome to Dark Souls RPG Maker Edition. And boom. Ah. Uh... Well, 
I guess that's how that works. Yeah, find some loot, blah, blah, blah. Enter, you know, escape takes me to the thing. Yeah, this is like RPG Maker style. Doors and portals. There's a hole in the floor. Let's jump in it. Goodbye. Whee. 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 Ooh, there's a ship. Okay. Fast roll emerges. Well, random encounters scattered and well played in the field. Up ahead, you can need to pass through the enemy encounters in order to conclude this tutorial and reach the end. So, whoop. Wow, these are pretty uh, detailed, like, sprites. I wonder where they got all these things from. Spurter emerged! I have one HP. Attack it! Uh, well, I evaded. What the? Everybody yeah, right, I evaded the attack. I have no HP. Blizzard! Special. Magic Reflect! It's not going to let me die here. Ooh, I gained experience. Just out of curiosity, uh, status. 6223. I'm just curious if it's actually going to do that. Congratulations completed. I can raise in order to continue the game. It's portal ahead. Whoop. All right, moving back onto the game. Now I'm, I'm actually curious still. Oh my gosh, did it really do that to me? It gave me the experience from the tutorial, but it also left me with no HP. Are you kidding me? Oh, this is going to be great. What? What the hell is this? Oh, look, they're ready to dance with me. This is going to be dumb. I have fallen. I can't believe that. You're kidding me. The tutorial lets you keep all the experience you earn, but it does not. What is that sound in the background? I can't even understand what that sound is. But now I have to go and do it again. Boop. Oh, that's right. So, now out of curiosity, I'm just going to say no, skip the tutorial. So that way I have HP. Wait, what the hell is this? Oh my god! See, I have HP now, which is dumb. So I'm blind? Not too blind for magic, right? Are you kidding me? What? These things are like ridiculously powerful. Well, I'm glad I earned some experience there, but now I have to get out. Oh, or was that it? Okay, it looks like I was safe there. Oh my god, what the hell happened to him? Oh my gosh! They're all... On fire! Game over. Are you crapping me? Ah, my head. Ah, would you like to take tutorial? No, I don't want to be teleported to a magical place. What the hell is this? Ah, attack. This should be a little bit easier by just using fire. I mean, it's the beginning of the game. I shouldn't have died three times. A healing spell would have been nice, too. 
And I thought that was like some kind of old man Indian with, uh, uh, you know, like paint under his eyes. But apparently those are red eyes of zombies. Um, which means I should go this way. Oh god, what the hell happened to him? Ah, I don't even know who's talking. Really? Are you kidding me? I think Dark Souls had an easier time than this. Because I have no items. My magic is limited to this. Well, is that magic defense or normal defense? I don't know. Right now, I'd have to say asking money for this kind of game is kind of like a slap to people in the face right now. Because uh, I have no way of healing myself. And I take so much damage... And so little experience that I there's nothing I can do. Well, I guess I can try. Well, no, because then I have to go around. There's a chest in the way. I don't even know if the chest disappear. <sighs> do I have anything I can do? Skills? No, I've got magic reflect, enhanced spell, nightmare. I apparently have a crossbow. Fur hat, leather top, winged boots. Optimize. Well, let's go for it. Ha! <laughs> ah, you can escape. Oh, I feel very sick. I would too after playing this game. I... What the... I feel very sick, and so I have to use healing items. Like, let me teach you how to use this now. Which is dumb. That is a lot of potions it now gave me. I mean, I'm like set for life now. And all I had to do was run away. This whole place is falling apart. There's no time. Even though there's plenty of time. AU is the... Isn't that the chemical symbol for gold? That's a lie. There's an oven. Please help me. Ah, uh, what? Not even sure what that was. Hello, bat. That's just kind of floating there. Damn it! I hate bats. <laughs> oh, and I can't escape out of that one. Well, let's just, well, do what we do. Set things on fire. Boop. Excuse me, sir. You seem to be in my way. Oh, get out of my way. Don't make me hurt you. Oh, look. That's how you can avoid all combat. I must get out. No! Boop. Uh, achievement unlocker. Move through this passage right to unlock all achievements. Sure, why not? Oh, look at this. A, B, C... D E F. <laughs> you know, I feel so achieved by unlocking all the achievements by walking to the frickin' right. Are you kidding me?
Let's just make it so I can't go anywhere. Oh, look at the glorious rendering of these trees! Shady, just right there. Got all the way to P now instead of getting achievements. One, two, three. I think I got all the achievements now. The village is infested by monsters. They're everywhere. We need to get to the infernal portal and close it by defeating the boss. Let's work together. Defeat the monsters and become powerful enough to kill the boss. <laughs> what kind of storyline is this? What am I going to do? Gain a level now? From chests? No, oh, just want to leave. I don't need to fight anything. Oh, there's another one. Oh, look at the cute little mices. Oh my god. Goodbye. <laughs> wow. Are you serious? All these battles consecutively. <laughs> Arya's now level 21. Monica's now level, tw level 21. Wait a moment. You're giving me experience for this? I'm already like level 20? Monica kind of looks like a dude, almost. Almost. Oh no, ghosts! Run! Oh look, there's an inn. Oh, apparently there's ghosts in front of the inn. Hmm, maybe I shouldn't go there. I'll just run away from everything. Whee! Look at all these chests! I'm now level 22! Let's go to the inn. Let's actually go into the inn. Wait, I enter from the bottom and come out the top as the world rotates. Are you kidding me, right? Look, more stuff. Ha! <laughs> well, yeah, I'll just take everything. Thank you. Because I'm vicious. Thank you. What can I buy? Yeah, hey, stranger, how's it going? I was just complaining about you stealing my stuff, but not nah, doing it anyway. Really? Why don't I just afford everything? That doesn't even tell you what, uh, well, I guess that does. Uh, plus 12 something. Oh, that's a crown. It's a hat. Okay. Mithril Dragon Plate, plus 20. Dragon Cap. Why don't we just sell everything in the first shop you're at? You know, I'm going to go look around first before making my decision. Oh, item shop. And it sounds like everything's on fire! Ooh, I like weapons. Oh, look, more free stuff. Let me guess, you're going to fight me for it, though. Oh, it's just 500? I don't want that. Oh, no. <laughs> so, either way, I gained 500. I don't really feel like fighting the shopkeep. Who knows if it even make me do that. I'm just... Explodes. Alright, magic time! Would you like to trade? Yes, I need some items. Elix it's only a thousand for elixir. Once you wear it, you cannot take it off ever. I want... 99. Thank you. Because I needed 99. Wait. Wait a moment. Let me see here. I'm going to look at this. Uh, let's see. Items. <laughs> oh, it's great. I'm going to go look at that now. So, status. Defense, 107. Are you kidding me? 
Is there a magic defense too? Let me look. Yeah, there's a magic defense. Uh, I need some items. I'm gonna buy. Yeah, let's buy some magic up. We're gonna go and. 34 of those. We're gonna get another 31 of those. We're gonna. Mm. Yeah, I've got 34, 31. My luck. Do I need luck? Magic up. Uh, yeah, we're going to go with uh, more guard. We want more defense. Another 30 of those. We're going to increase this main character up. Items. Okay, out of those. Magic up. Ah, let's do this one too. And let's look at our stats. Woohoo! We're super powered! Who needs to level up when you can do this? Totally ridiculous. Um, yeah, you know what? We still have more money to go gather from outside since there's so many chests. And then I'm going to come back in. I'm just going to boost up my stats. I don't need to level up. I don't need to do anything. I just need to go find some boxes. You know what? Actually, let's let's see what happens now. Monica took 33 damage. Yeah, I kind of reduced the amount of damage I take. Just slightly. Uh, let's go grab that chest, though. Oh, even more chests. Jeez, they're everywhere. Ugh. Your party has fled. Ugh. I think I can finish this game in one run. 5,000. There we go. And I have to go all the way around. And these are all like random battle things like, yeah, I guess what? Here's another random battle. But it never fails to run away. I could be a pacifist. And then go fill myself up with, uh, you know, drugs from the store to make myself super powered. And let's go here. I've learned stuff that doesn't matter to me. I'm just collecting more money. <gasps> Wisps. Goodbye. I mean, this storyline is just so engaging. Jellyfish! Jellyfish randomly in the middle of town. How do I get that last place over there, though? What would I do for a repel? Oh, well, let's skip that chest. Level 25, more money. Because, you know, everyone just leaves their money in chests and everywhere. Everything everywhere. Oh, look, even more. All of, like, the same crap over and over again. Hello, zombies. I'm going to escape while I have the chance. Oh, look, there's an item shop. Is this really... Door is locked. We can't get... Because it's all connected to the inn. I mean... I've seen toddlers have greater built games than this. I've built better games than this. I've only made one. Probably has better fighting, better equipment, and all that kind of stuff, and it has none of it. But there's all these pictures, all these creatures. And then there. Because it's just all 5,000, 5,000, 5,000. Oh, look! Cockatrice. I, those things are petrify, right? Doesn't matter. Run away. Run over here. Whoop. I'm not even sure exactly what they had planned for these games. Because I'm just running through gathering all this stuff. I'm going to head back to the shop soon. Uh, and I'm going to, well, buy my stats. 
And you I've gained nine left woo. Let's see how my magic does against this. Let's set you uh oh, there's flame two instead of fire two. Aw. And you can escape while asleep. That makes no difference. Seriously? Oh, you're back. How's it going? Too bad I'm escaping. More chests. The door is locked. Can't even get into the church. I mean, is this like the pre-alpha to the pre-alpha? Am I still in the tutorial? So each area seems to have their own monsters to face. Whoops. Thought I did something there. Still going. Ooh, a demon emerged. Bye. I'm not done. I want to get more stats first. Calm down. Oh, did escaping fail? That was the first. Orcs! We are lumberjacks and we're okay. Hello, spiders. I don't care about the spiders. Let's go increase our stats some more. Whoop, no! So weird arriving from the top of the building. I didn't even talk to her. Who is she? Sure, we'll rest a while. Lovely music box sound as we're burning alive inside of this burning building, which I didn't even see fire. I need some items. I have 154,000 right now. Okay, I'm going to buy that many of that. I'm going to buy that many of that. Let's increase my guards some more, just so I have all this defense, because I don't actually have a way of increasing my HP. Um, magic, ma yeah, and so that increases my magic damage. Yeah, that makes more sense. Oh, mana up. Yeah, you know what, let's get a little bit more mana. Items. Items. Because this doesn't seem unnecessary at all. If I'm rich enough to increase my power like that, why why do I even have to bother? Oh, I can't hold down the enter button. I was hoping to make it easier. Magic up. Oh no! Look at it drop. Holy cow! I think I don't need any more magic up on that. I still have a ridiculous amount of money, so let's buy some more stuff. Which would be... More resist, because I want the defense. More magic, because I want more magic. More guard, because I want more guard. And I won't have to worry about MP, because I'll just go rest and have a ridiculous amount of MP to go fight. Uh... And I don't need equipment. I could run in there naked, honestly, with this kind of stats. What are my stats at, anyway? <laughs> 505, 466, and 467. Hmm, maybe I should increase my agility a bit. First of all, let's just go back to what I was doing. I want to know how much damage I'll take at this point for the amount of stats that I'm giving myself. You know, I would actually be surprised if this was just like, oh, this only lasts like two battles. 
but I really doubt that they thought that far ahead. I like breaking stuff, um, but this was already broken before I ever touched it. Oh, let's save. Yeah, I saved. Formation, status. Your stats are now 802. Okay. I, I can't attack for beans, but I have a massive defense. My muscles are so insanely, like, durable that jet fuel can't melt them. Um, hmm. Yeah, let's make my agility really high and see what happens there. Because I still have money, right? Yeah, I've got enough. Let's let's do a, a thing of, like, 40 of that. And then we'll do magic up again. There. I think that's a good amount of money. I think I should be set for the rest of the game. At least stat-wise. I've become a god. Watch them do one damage to me. All right, let's go. Let's go outside and fight something. Bring it, spiders. We're going to have her use her magic. Blizzard. 2,304 damage. Yeah, look at that. Behold. And I gained 39 experience. I get more money and experience points from opening locks than I do anything else. Ooh, a chimera emerged. Let's, let's, uh, we're going to give you a flame two and you can just attack. Boosh. 1,222 damage. And then we'll continue on our way. Oh, look, there's more chests. A mimic! That isn't menacing at all. I mean, no, seriously, it's not menacing at all. Because I, I'll use my... Ignoring... De uh, wait. Deals defense. <laughs> deals defense. Ignoring damage to one enemy. So this should do no damage according to what it says. It should deal total defense. Nope, apparently deals damage. I guess it's broken. Wait, that gave a lot of experience for that thing. Yep, more. Oh, look, another one. Let's do it again. Oh, I learned another thing. What did I learn? I don't know, but so far it's unimportant. Do it again. Kaboom! It actually took more than one damage. Lots of money, though. Yeah, I'm gathering the money still because I'm a moron. Fish people! What happens if I use Blizzard 2 on you guys? Oh, that's what I learned. Blizzard 2. Oh, no. Cannot cast magic? I'll just run away. Oh, nope. With no magic, she's kind of worthless. Didn't even think about that being a, an ability. 31. Woohoo! Doors locked, can't get in. Because everywhere's locked. Hey, an ogre! Because you're like onions. Uh, I'm going to give you a big burst. In the gut. 2,600 damage. And lots of money. Wait, I have to go back down? This is not going to lead me anywhere? Dang it. Okay, let's try this again. Boom, Blizzard 2. 2,000. 1,000. Eat it. I mean, all these boxes have the same damn thing in them continuously. Uh, what were they thinking? I'm, like, powerful enough that I could probably destroy the planet in five minutes or ten episodes, depending on your Dragon Ball Z reference. Uh, yeah, you know what? I'm just running. Oh, what? No! 
Preventing me from using magic. Oh no. Uh, continuing on our epic adventure. And here I was worried about gaining levels in that beginning part. Like, you know, exploiting that thing that where it gave you experience while in the tutorial. But that was like one of the, the least of the worries of this game. I know, I know. A lovely succubus. Delicious. Until she dies. Oh, come on. Don't put me to sleep. Ah, skip it. I don't need any more chests. Ah, demon. Hello, demon. Um, let's see what happens if I use a burst on you. Boom! Wow, it has HP. That's impressive. Unfortunately, I have defense. For you, anyway. <laughs> no, I can't see now. Oh. Boom! Wow, hold on. So, out of nowhere, this demon shows up, and it can take a serious beatdown from me. It can't hurt me, but it now can take a serious beatdown compared to everything else. Boom, and it's slain. That's a lot of stuff for that. Yeah, I'm going over to that. I don't need to, but... Oh, come on. Oh, come on, let me escape. I've already done plenty of this. Yeah, even up here, it's just the same. Let's go inside this building. I think that's what it wants, anyway. The Demon Lair. Uh, let's... You know, just to be on the safe side. I gotta use these elixirs. Ah, oh, they're expensive, though. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Oh, look, whatever you are. Crab thing? <laughs> Are you sure you're powerful enough to engage the boss? Yes, yes, I will engage the, the boss changed. Oh, hello again. Moth demon thing. Demon god emerges. Um, let's go with uh, magic. And we'll go with burst. Whoa, actually, I took a decent amount of damage from that nuclear thing. Apparently it ignores defense, I guess. Oh, can't use magic. You know, I should have increased my normal attack then. Uh. Oh. Items, elixir, why not? Uh, special, cleave, provoke. Yeah, this thing's actually still doing damage, which is weird. I mean, what were they... I, I haven't even quite figured out. Is this the end of the game? This this one god right here? Demon god? Uh, magic. Can't use magic still. You know, there's nothing. I didn't even check the potion shop. Hmm. Attack. Boop. Let's wait until I can use magic again. So, now that I can use magic, let's use... Don't really have much of a choice here. Sure, let's go Blizzard. Boom! Lots of damage. 
Uh, I do need to, however, heal myself for once. Can I use a potion? Thank you. All right, let's go back to magic and then go back to using first for all we know. Ow. Boom. At least now I can attack again. Fight. Uh... Nope, I think I have I don't actually choose who I use this on. Yeah, I do. Okay. Well, we'll try and get her to continually use magic while the other person just is the heal slave. Boop! And then we'll just continue. I mean, what else am I supposed to do? Oh, crap. Boom, dead. Why does it get so many turns? Well, it looks like I'm going to die here. Are you kidding me? I guess I should have increased the speed by a lot more. Oh, let me use magic. Explode! That's fine. You can do that as long as I get to cast my skills. Don't. No! This is what happens, and this is where I can die. Boop! Ow. Oh, now I can't use magic again. Great. Yeah, the elixir should, like, clear that up, shouldn't it? Apparently not. Special, we're gonna go... Hey, why didn't I just use this? Ah, oh, that is great. We're just going to keep doing this for a little while. Okay, now I can go and use my magic. That's fine. Use nuclear. Confusion? No. Bad. Am I going to die now? Yeah, I'm going to die. Unless it lets me go first. Game over. That thing is ridiculous. Total waste of time. And so now I can continue my game because fortunately I saved beforehand. Why I'm still playing this is beyond me. But for the sake of argument here, I saved at that point, which was... Yeah, okay, that was a good point to save. Because um, now what I want is to change what I buy. Yes, I need some items. I want to buy... I need more speed by a lot. And then you know that that's a weird thing. I wonder if it actually is broken that way. No, it's not. Dang. Hoping I was going to be able to sell a whole bunch of random stuff. Yeah, I'm going to go beat that boss. I'm going to actually make you guys 
watch all of this. Because, you know, this is how great games are made. I need more speed. Because the more speed I have means I can uh, it doesn't get so many turns in a row. At least that's what I think anyway. But now I have to go back to those like difficult guys, which aren't really difficult, but you get the idea. Moving up. Ugh. A rates. They're called rates, actually. I, I didn't even realize that. I know it's about how I'm going to rate this game. A Chimera. Magic burst. Boom. Look at all that money. Not really. We're going to go fight some demons. It's a better use of my time, anyway. Ooh. Now, let's just... Boom! Boop! Really? This thing can survive several attacks. I should definitely increase my magic attack some more, as well. How is it still alive? Is this a big boss? Give me lots, right? 4,008. No, that wasn't even worth it. Blizzard 2 learned. Nope, we, we want to fight demons, because you're not worth my effort. But let's explore this way a bit. See if I can walk across that. Ah, there's what we're looking for. Hello, demon. Boom! Because that thing barely did any damage, even to the person that didn't have stats. So it ignores, like, defense and doesn't really have an attack damage. It just ensures that you take damage. Boop! Are you dead yet? Seriously. Thank you. Oh, no, I can't go that way. Do I really need to deal with you over and over again? There's only like two types of enemies here. And why is there still fire sound? What happens if I use Blizzard instead? Nope, that's not a good idea. Uh, flame 2? Nope. Yeah, it really looks like Burst is the ultimate attack. Wait, now it's taking less damage. What the heck? There we go, 1400. Hello, demon. Oh no, not Monica. No! How do I revive people anyway? Is there a way of reviving people? You hit me for what? Nothing. That's right. Because I am freaking awesome. And let's investigate. Oh, look, another chest. So close yet so far away. Uh, boop. With the other one dead, it makes it a little bit easier to just choose what I want to fight with. Because I, I don't even know how Arya and Monica know each other. They're just like, let's go defeat the boss together. Epic adventure time! With so many elixirs, I'm really set for life. Oh, 
Oh no, no damage? Means you absorb nothing. Ta-da! How much money do I have now? I have 85, 86,000. I need more. I want another, like, you know, 100,000, which won't take me that long with how this is going, but it's still annoying as heck. Oh, I'm asleep? It's good that I wake up. Oh no, I can't use burst again. I need to. Whoops. Didn't mean to guard. Boom! Thank you. Whoop de doo for level 33. Uh, is there anything in here? Apparently not. The only safe spot is inside of there. I know, I'm wasting your guys' time, but I really, really just have to do this in one sitting and actually beat this game that they want to charge money for. Because, okay, I'm going to tab over there right now. So what they're expecting for this is what? Oh, they don't even have a price set for it, but their previous games that they had uh, were set for $2.99 a piece, which whoever paid that, I am sorry. I hope you got a refund for the garbage that you have paid for. Um, I'm usually not that mean when it comes to things, but holy cow, this game is just broken. There's no story. There's no that you wake up and you're not sure where you are, but guess what? Run outside and just have... Ha wreak havoc amongst the town against all the monsters everywhere. There's only one building you can actually enter. Two, technically, if you want to go fight the boss. Uh, am I at 100,000? Hmm. Yeah, I need... No, 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 that's fine, that's fine. We're just gonna go up our magic like crazy. Do far more damage. Oh, look, a demon! That'll definitely give me something more. Boom! Because I need speed and I need, uh, well, magic attack. Goodbye. Thank you for the 12,000. Woohoo! Oh, maybe this is where all the demons are. Can I get any more skills? I wonder where they got all of these, like, things from. Because uh, they're kind of cool. They would have been cool in this kind of game if this game was actually a story. But this raise crap that they have is just nothing. There is nothing here that makes this worth any effort whatsoever. And the only reason I'm doing this is hopefully I'm entertaining someone out there with the rant that I'm giving about how the hell they release games like this. I mean, it makes me, I want to put my game on green light. The reason why I want to put my game on green light is because if stuff like this gets green lit, holy hell. Welcome back. I'd like to up my stats some more. We're going to buy one instance of that and one instance of that. And I'm just lugging around a dead body like it's nothing. I mean, I probably could have made it like a physical attack that I could have uh, set up, but I think that monster probably has some kind of defense just for that, the sake of that.
I feel like I'm jumping in Mario continuously. Oh, that wasn't enough. Please, give me more drugs. Magic up! Yeah, I'm gonna do another speed up. Because that thing was way too fast. Oh, I probably should use them first. Boop! And while she's dead, she gains no experience. That's sad. Not really. What's my stat stats? Which would be... Oh, 999. It seems to be the maximum. Agility, 999 seems to be the max. Okay, so now I need to up everything else, I guess. Kind of wasted some money there, but let's save so I don't have to do that all again. Um... Because if I power up... No, wait, 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 wait. I have 47,000. Let's see if there's anything I can buy in the item shop. A weapon shop. Let's see. Plus 60 attack. That's just physical attack, though. And that does what? Does it increase my magic attack at all? Ether Blast Gun. Not like I need to increase my magic attack anyway. Let's move on back to the item shop. Which was, what, this one? Oh no, that's the armor shop. We don't need that at all. Uh, let's see. Oh, look, a stimulant. We can bring people back from the dead. Let, let's buy one. Treats many status ailments. Let's carry 20 of those. Power of Earth, engraved with the goddess of luck. Symbol worn by gods. I mean, this doesn't tell me what these things do. Ring with the hidden power of a genie. So does it make me invincible? I don't even know what any of that does. That, that that just seems kind of pointless. Um, at least I got some items that will now heal myself. And we will go back and up stats some more. So I've got, you know, physical defense, which is unimportant. I've got the magic resist up. I've up my magic. I up my speed. I should be faster than anything. Um, I don't even know what luck does. Yeah, I should be set anyway. Let's just do that and save the rest of the money for nothing. Alright, so we've got everything. Let's save. Let's go destroy the demon god. King. Thing. Whatever. Oh. I have a dead body following me, I just realized. Um, Let's wake up. 1 HP. Okay, straight to the demon god. And we're going to save before it. All these monsters are in territory where it's saying, no, you can't leave these specific areas.
I need to know the age of the person that made this. Because it seems like they knew what things should be more powerful than others in most cases. Or they use default things. I don't know. I've never really messed with this, like, RPG Maker stuff. Okay, now that we're here, we're going to go boop, 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 save. You know, that was such a long walk to get here. And when you talk to it, it turns into the demon, which is weird. Uh, no, I need to prepare. Yes, engage the boss. And this should be relatively easy now. Burst! It still gets two turns. And then we're going to go burst. And then we're going to go uh, elixir on you. So yeah, I am faster than it. Maybe I should have made the other person faster. Hopefully this is enough, though. I wish I could see how much HP this thing has, though. Great, no magic. Fine, I'll use an item on myself. Uh, what was that? Dispel herb? Uh, and then... You have magic? What can we do here? Oh! There is a healing thing. The other person had it. That seems kind of pointless. Um, paralyze. Boom. I don't need to be, you know, see anything in order to burst the crap out of crap. Nuclear! Ooh. Almost dead. Let's, just in case, because I'm faster than everything, heal myself. And then you, if you survive, you heal yourself. Perfect. Let's, uh, why not? Keep you alive. Whoop. At least I can go first every turn now. Oh, great. That's a good way to starting this out. With the epic battle going on in the background, or I mean the epic music going on in the background, we see death in our minds. Hopefully we will survive this experience before it is too late. But while this monster has every ability under the sun, we do not hold out hope for survival. But we do, because technically we are kicking its ever-living ass. This is its natural habitat being a crab, moth, demon, tentacled, uh, venomous snake thing. Thing. I don't know. It should just die. Boom! Are you dead yet? I mean, these are like the most ridiculously boring battles ever. The dialogue doesn't exist. Uh, I want to see what the end of this game is. And I'm making you all bear with me, as this is stupid. Most of you probably fast forward to the, the, the fight again, which is fine. Boop! Confusion. Confusion, ha! Boom! 
It was slain! Victory! 50,000 dollars. Now level 35, level 33. Congratulations, you have defeated the boss. <laughs> Wait, what? Play the piano. Um, congratulations, you defeated the boss. Who congratulated me? Well, let's, you know, before anything else, make sure we save. Burning Village. That's still infested with monsters? I've defeated your boss. Did anything open up at all? Is there really no end to this? What the hell was the purpose of this game? I mean, you don't do anything. There is nothing. Can I go up? Maybe there's something in the far distance up? Maybe? No, that's right. It's just... It, uh. We're just going to go all the way back to the beginning and see if anything happens. Wait, no, I need to go down. That's right. Out of all the games that I've received keys for to review, this by far is the worst. People sell these games to earn money, and that's all they are. They don't actually put any effort or time or anything into thinking of the people that they're selling it to. If they find this game fun, they are seriously messed up in the head. Oh, I can't go back in there again. Um, because there's nothing in this game. It's this one freaking map. I've already defeated the ultimate boss. There is no game over screen or, you know, victory. Okay, yeah, that's it. That's it. There's nothing here. Uh, yeah. Don't buy this game. This game is trash. It's garbage. It's worthless. It is nothing. You play the beginning part, get yourself some achievements. End of story. It has nothing else for you because there is no storyline. There is no effort put into this game. I put more effort into playing this game than the creator made. I put more effort taking a dump in the bathroom than the creator put into making this game. I have put more effort into waking up in the morning than the creator put into this game. And you know what? I'm going to take more effort to turn off this game than the creator put into this game. I hope they get removed from Steam because out of every game that I have done reviews for, this by far is the most selfish money grabbing game series on the planet and they shouldn't be they shouldn't call themselves game creators so i know you guys didn't have fun i didn't have fun i broke the game i broke the game really bad because guess what the game was already broken they give you the ability to give yourself unlimited stats money and experience everywhere and you don't have to have any effort to do anything this game was completed in, well, way more time than I should have. It was an hour and nine minutes. But I put an hour and nine minutes into this game that probably only took nine minutes to make. I'll catch you guys in the next review. Have a good one.